In this activity, we're going to be looking at hyperlinks and bookmarks and cross-references. Let us have a look at the document first. I'm going to scroll down. Here we have headings and text. We need to do something over here. More headings and text. Here we have an image with auto caption. Here we have an image with a caption, figure one, cute photo. There we have an image with a caption. Here we have an appendix. And here we have another appendix. Right. We need to create a hyperlink from the word competition on page two. We need to create a hyperlink from that word to a bookmark. So select it. Insert. Links. Link. It needs to link to a bookmark in this document. Here are the bookmarks. It needs to link to example competition. And the screen tip must display an example. It's a hyperlink and there's my screen tip. Now we need to replace this blue with a cross-reference to a heading, Appendix, Article, Submission, Form. Now to insert a cross-reference, I can go to Insert, Links, Cross-reference, or I could go to References, Cross-reference. I'm going to Insert, Links, Cross-reference. I would like that blue to link to a heading. Reference type, it's a heading. I would link it, I would like it to link to the heading Appendix Article Submission Form. I would like it to link as a hyperlink. And I would like the heading text to be displayed. Now, as I click Insert, watch that. The heading text is there. Now, this green, I would like to replace that green with a cross-reference to a photograph. Links, cross-reference. Not a heading, a photograph. Now, a photograph is a figure. I would like it to link to figure one cute photo. I would like it to link as a hyperlink. And I would like the whole caption, the entire caption to be displayed. Now, as I click there, watch the, what happens there. Yes, the whole caption is displayed. Let me scroll down, I have to find some text highlighted in red. There it is. Now this text, I would like it to be replaced with a cross-reference to the heading Appendix Apps. Links, cross-reference. I would like it to link to a heading And the heading is Appendix Apps. But I would like you to display just the page number. And as I click Insert, watch there. Page 9. OK. Now, this piece of art needs a caption. So select it. I'm going to go to References. Insert caption. It is picked up. Figure one, it is a figure. 
and it needs the heading winning picture. And it needs to be below the selected item. Correct. But on page seven, there were some images there. That was figure one. It's changed. That was figure two. It has changed. I'd need to go back to my reference on the second page. The reference to that. I'm going to right click. And I would like to update the field because it now needs to be figure two. Correct. We've had a look at cross references and links. They're all useful in a long document.